Now the next assembly would be master rod assembly. Now to start with the master rod assembly, go to start mechanical design and assembly design workbench over here. Insert our master rod into the assembly workbench. Second component would be piston assembly. And third component would be our upper rod bushing. Now we'll use the manipulation tool to set these parts apart. At first we will go inside upper rod bushing axis with the this whole axis. Make this axis go inside and provide a offset constant between this particular surface and this surface of rod bushing with the offset of 0 mm. Now if you update the figure you can see upper rod bushing fitted into the hole. Now we need to go inside the piston hole axis with the this particular hole axis so you can see the piston is assembled with the master rod but the angle is not accurate so we have to define the angle constant between this particular surface and this master rod surface and we want to make it perpendicular so define the angle of 90 degree and if, if you update the figure you can see the complete master rod assembly we can save th this assembly as piston and master rod assembly one 